Hey guys, welcome to day four of my 12 days of Christmas. Today we have this pretty pink Mama Claus cup and it says, let's get jolly on the back. I just thought it was so fun and it's very festive without being your typical Christmas colors. So if you're a fan of pink, and uh, girly, but you wanna do some Christmas stuff, this is for you. Uh, I just thought it was so fun and very different. So let's get into the tutorial and make sure you come back for day five tomorrow. So starting off with this kind of water bottle style cup, this is the Mana brand. I believe I got this at Ross or TJ Maxx. It was a while ago, so I don't have the tag on it, but prepping it with Mattify. Then I'm gonna tape off the top rim part because I don't wanna get any paint or anything on that. So I like to use electrical tape for this. It just works really well. You can kind of stretch it around and make it fit on there really nice. Using the Glam Color Fix paint, Then smoothing that out with one of our large paint brushes. It's really just a fluffy makeup brush. So just any fluffy makeup brush will do, but it really helps to smooth this paint out and give you just a nice smooth application. And I don't know why I didn't put this on some foam or something in like a holder, but I, was painting it and I was holding it with my hand, so I just had to go with it. I had carefully set that down, trying not to touch the paint. Then once that was dry, I'm going on with Tack It over and over. I've used this a couple times and I did not realize before that you had to wait and let it dry. So that's what I'm doing now. So just spreading it on and I don't know why I used a glove. I've never done it that way before, uh, but I just, I decided to use a glove. So you can use brush, glove, whatever you want to spread that out. Then I think I waited 45 minutes and I'm going on with white cap in small. I really love doing this technique with white cap. It really looks pretty on like any color that you could do. So then once you have that on there, you're just gonna take a gloved hand and just kind of gently rub on there and it flattens the glitter and gives it that really cool metallic looking, I don't know, it just makes the glitter look so cool and I love this technique. It just gives such a different look than just the glitter on its own. So just doing that all the way around the cup. So I did a layer of epoxy, and then I'm going on with these water slides. These are just some flowers I found on Etsy. I will link them down below. I thought that just doing a black kind of outline of flowers would look really pretty. So just putting that in the water for like 15 seconds, then putting it on my cup and sliding it off. And I've gotten a few comments that you can actually do a water slide and place it like face down and then just peel off the backing. So I have yet to try that, but that would be so much easier than sliding it out from underneath. I don't know why we do it this way, 
But if the other way works, I'm doing it that way from now on. So just smoothing that out and trying to get out any water underneath. Then doing the next one on the top. Then once that was dry, I added some quick seal just to kind of seal that in and make sure it didn't move when I do my layer of epoxy. So then I cut out some pink and black vinyl and it says Mama Claus. This is also from Etsy. I thought it was so cute. So I just weeded that out and then I'm going to stack them. Then I ended up adding a third vinyl. This one is like a silver kind of glittery one, but I just wanted it to really pop more. Then I am using this tool. This is from Cami Page Boutique. And this tool I have used so much. It is seriously amazing. But for uh, centering decals, you kind of just put it on the little part there and then you can center it on your cup and you get a straight decal every time. It also does a bunch of other features and I cannot say more about this tool. I'll have it linked down below for you guys. But it's it's really, it's just a game changer once you get this. The snow is falling down. I've been longing for this then I did the same uh, three vinyls in the back in this Let's Get Jolly SVG, also from Etsy. I just thought that would be a really cute touch to this Mama Claus cup. This one I just placed on by hand since it was so big and I didn't line it up with the grid when I put it on. Whenever I'm doing a decal by hand, I just kind of set it up and just look at it straight on. I just feel like you can see it better than when it's laying flat. So then I also wanted to quick seal those vinyls just because I stacked three of them. Sometimes you'll get one that pops up and I was having a little bit of trouble with the black ones not wanting to stay down. So I sealed that once that was dry. I went on with two more layers of epoxy. Then it was done. So it was time to take it off the turner and put the lid back on. And it was all done. It's so pretty. I love this. I love that it's festive and Christmassy, but it's still pink and girly and just so fun. Bye. 
So that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and make sure you come back for day five tomorrow. Bye guys.